So the first part of the museum is a, we call it a railway gallery, which has got um, well, some models. It's also got the kind of thing I like, which is some books from World War Two, And then um, some personal artefacts. books, there's lots more um, which I haven't shown you, and then you come into the main display. So it's uh, a mixture of modern here, by the way. And there's the outside as well. There's a display of Lon London Manston Airport, which I didn't know was a thing. <laughs> Lots of models again. There's some of these planes that are landed here. Um, there's a presumably World War II bedroom. A bit musty on the glass there, sorry. And then here's the main display again. So it's like a World War One era on the left. So Wessex. So let's say uh, Sopworth. That's I think is a French plane. Newport. Replicas, base replicas, so not originals. Got the Wessex. Now from the rear of a jet I do not recognise. Oh, so I'll keep. Operation chest eyes. It's one of the bouncing bombs, or what's left of it. I wonder where that one's come from, does it say? It doesn't say. At least I can't see. So it's this one. Oh. Grasshopper. I don't know if it's that or the glider above it. So it's, it's meteor, it is. Right. Yeah, the grasshopper is the glider. It's got one of those racing planes, doesn't it? And then this is an American. What is that? Parachute. Oh, here it is. Bomb retarding parachute. And this is... Canada Silver Star. Look at the size of this J79 turbojet engine. I mean, it just goes on and on and on. <laughs> it's enormous. This is a Mark 8 torpedo. These things are enormous. We're on the outside part now, so that's uh, what does it say? An English Electric Lightning. Okay. 
Project Provost T4. Let's go a bit wider here. Better view from this side. closed. Okay, there's a weird old collection of stuff here. I'm afraid the sun's in the wrong place. I'm going to pause. I know not. Fire engine. That's it. Check one. 